The Chevy Set Collector's Card Series. I saw this package at an antique store. So I bought four or five um, cards. And I opened them up and checked them out. And they are actually pretty cool. They came out in 1992. And one of the packs I opened actually had the first card in it. I thought that, or, you know, card number one. And I thought that was cool. Yeah, um, 1992. That's a long time, these things. Card number one. That is a picture of Louis Chevrolet. Louis Chevrolet had established himself as a successful and well-known race car driver with the Buick race team. William C. Durant, who had originally organized General Motors Corp., was aware of Louis Chevrolet's interest in becoming an automobile designer. What Durant liked most about Louis Chevrolet was his name. Together, they incorporated the Chevrolet Motor Car Company in November of 1911. This is a rarely seen photo of Louis Chevrolet and a Model C six-cylinder was introduced in November 1911. It is actually a 1912 model and was the first car to bear the Chevrolet nameplate. Louis Chevrolet claimed that he had secretly tested the car at 4 in the morning on a road outside of Detroit and had reached a speed of 110 miles per hour. He had been stopped by a constable and fined thirty dollars, five for speeding and twenty-five for impersonating a famous race car driver. In 1914, Louis Chevrolet left the company in dispute with William C. Durant and disposed of all the stock. In the later years of his life, he said his greatest source of pride was the two Indy 500 winner winners he designed and built. He died on June 6, 1941, in Detroit at the age of 62. He was buried in Indianapolis, Indiana.